Hi guys, here we are at the CES Las Vegas event and we have the HTC 8X device on our hands on. We are going to quickly show you all the features of this device which is the Windows Phone 8 device. Let us get started with the specifications of this device. The device comes with 4G support and also supports only micro SIM. If you are having a normal SIM you need to actually get it cut or you need a micro SIM for this. Apart from that when you talk about the weight it's quite slim. Uh, when you talk about the weight it's quite low at just 130 grams and the device comes with a 4.3 inches display with 342 ppi pixel density along with a Corning Gorilla Glass 2 support which is pretty good you can ensure that the screen cannot get any scratches and also the device is quite slimmer when you check it out from the sides as you can see here on the back you have the 8 megapixel camera with LED flash On the top you have the 3.5mm headset jack. On the top you have the lock button. On the right you have the volume rockers. And on the bottom right you have the dedicated camera switch using which you can capture the pictures directly. On the bottom you have the micro USB port wherein you can insert the micro USB cable along with the microphone. This is the exterior point of view. Let us talk about the device. Let me go to the settings and show you the current OS version. So here under settings and about you would find the phone details. As you can see here, this is the OS version of 8.4, the Windows Phone 8, powered with Qualcomm Snapdragon S4 Plus. The device comes with 16 GB of internal storage and there is no option to increase the internal storage which you can find again under the settings. In the settings you have an option of storage and as you can see here it comes with 16 gig of total storage while the available storage would be only 14.56 and this is the internal storage comes with 1 GB of RAM which is quite low when compared to the other devices right now in the market which are recently coming up with 2 GB of RAM and apart from that the device supports NFC comes with micro USB support Bluetooth 3.1 not 4.0 and wireless LAN support when you talk about the camera the camera is 8 megapixel as I mentioned earlier. Now we are into the camera application capturing some pictures. Let me just try to capture the picture here. And the moment you tap on some specific area, it would actually focus. It also comes with face detection technology. And you can also go to the settings and change some options here. As you can see, you have an option of changing the effects from all these mentioned effects. You also have an option to change the resolution. Right now it's at 6 megapixel. Let me go to the 8 megapixel, which is the highest. You can change the white balance, increase or decrease the same, change the exposure, contrast, saturation and a lot, a lot of different settings. As you can see the face detection is also switched as on right now. So that is the camera application. You also have the video recording feature which again comes with a few effects. This is, uh, captures videos at 100p, 720p, VGA and QVGA. It's pretty decent. So that's the camera application. Let us just check out what else is here so since I have mentioned earlier that this is the Windows Phone 8 device you can easily drag and drop the applications from one place to other you can change the size of the application shortcuts here so as you can see here when you long press onto them you have a you get a small arrow here when you tap onto that you can change the size of the application shortcut to add more applications in this specific area you can also increase the size this way and make it quite wide so these are a few features which are coming on the Windows Phone 8 devices. You can also remove the application by tapping here. So that is the Windows Phone 8 feature and this is pretty much available on most of these Windows Phone 8 devices which are recently launched the Lumia 920, HTC 8X and many others. So this was a quick hands on on the HTC 8X. Stay tuned on Advices Media for more related videos. Thank you.